Do you li- you like being sober, walking through this pandemic world without um, the ability to dr- drop acid? <laughs> I I cannot imagine. No, my drug of choice now is uh, Netflix. Uh-huh. <laughs> everything. I mean, I have seen everything. You ask me about a show, as long as it's not a reality show. Uh, I could tell you what it was about. You want to give us some top picks? Yeah. Since there's so much sure. to look through. These are Lorraine Newman's top pick, <laughs> top pandemic picks. Okay, first of all, anything that is a Swedish noir, mm. any kind of, you know, Swedish uh, detective procedural, that stuff is so well done and so good. Also, British crime. I like a lot of crime dramas. Am I not? I'm very, that's very common, I think. A lot of comics I know or people in the area of comedy like crime dramas. Do you guys watch comedy at all? No, never. I never. I like it. Natasha does like it. I won't listen. I'll watch any comedy. I won't listen it to a comedy depends. podcast. I won't I only want hard drama. But you seem to like drama with an accent. <laughs> it's it's true. And that's true, Marsha. I do. I like it a lot that way. And um yeah, I don't know why. I don't know why that is. Um, well, the British, the British have a way of making things feel more dramatic. But I would say the nor the the Scandinavians feel thing, their accent makes things feel less dramatic. It's a little sillier, you know. Well, that's a matter of opinion. I think their stuff can be. There's a there's a trilogy called uh, Department Q, and it's three movies, and that stuff is dark, dark. Department Are you unbelievably? Q. Yeah, Department Q. It's three movies. Um, but oh my God, there's just so many shows. Uh, I just finished watching the second season of a Spanish show called Sky Rojo, and it's about um, a brothel in Spain and uh, all of the characters and the situations that happen with that. <laughs> uh, it's so brutal. I love. I, I I never I never watched this genre. No, so. Natasha definitely. But I think I would like it. What crime? No, but if it I has so. everything has like this kind of romantic, like you know, another another world, another language. Like I like subtitles too because I feel like it makes you watch the show and not be on your phone while you're. That's true. Although what some of the comedies that I did like, I loved your show, Natasha. I loved Another Period. That was Aww, a, what it was thank called. Thank you. Yes. I, I loved that show. I thought it was so good. It was so up my alley in every way. The tone of it. Oh, that's we should have had you on. I I would have loved to have been on, but you know, say lovey. Hey, thanks for checking out that clip of the Endless Honeymoon podcast. If you'd like to see some more highlights, you can click here. And if you'd like to subscribe, click here. And if you don't want to do either of those things, go fuck yourself.